Hello, this is Super Dragon 1006. I'm here to review the Transformers Faultless Cybertron website. It is on. It, the address is called TransformersGame.com. So, yeah, it shows you what pe other people think about it. Um, it shows you when it's coming out. You can pre-order right over here different languages so yeah and well no what crud me click the wrong thing oh well, yeah sure let's look at the characters first so here's Optimus Prime you can see down here he has the air strike ability. And here's Octans Prime in a thorough view. Doesn't really look bad. I think he looks pretty bulky though. It's the only thing I don't like about him. Here's his vehicle form. And on the side it doesn't look good. I don't like the side view. It just looks kinda weird. Um, front, I don't think I'd want to mess with that. The back looks really cool. So yeah, that they, they had to make the back and the front look cool. But since this is a third person, you're pretty much going to be seeing that in vehicle form. So you can see the cool stuff. Okay, let's go on to Bumblebee. Uh, they haven't revealed his ability yet. Um, but I don't know if he, he might not even have ability. Um, the only thing that I think has changed was his feet down here. It changed colors, they used to be black, and then the Autobot symbols right here. That's the only thing that changed from the War for Cybertron. You know, it's a sequel, so I think the character should look the same. Um, I don't think the vehicle form changed any. I'm not that sure. So. Yeah, I don't really think it's... I think it just got rougher. That's... See, you can see right in there. I don't think... I think this is the only difference. The roughness. Can't wait for this lows forever <coughs> so yeah and um they finally added cliff jumper so yeah cliff jumper is in here he does get cloaking like star scream over here he does get cloaking so yeah Here's Cliff Jumper, same thing as Bumblebee, only he has horns. And he's red. Same vehicle form, same everything. Since the vehicle form's the same, only different colors, I'm not even going to show it. It's not really worth showing. Uh, here's Jazz. You can, I don't think he really changed it. Too much from the character pack on War for Cybertron. As you can see over here, he gets the grapple ability, which allows him to grapple stuff. So, yeah, he does look pretty cool. Okay, so here's his car mode. Okay, so yeah, it's a it's a real nice car mode. Now here's Perceptor. They actually made him look cool for from the G1 series. He actually looks pretty cool. I mean, Perceptor, he's just like a telescope, but they made him look pretty cool. So yeah, that's what I like about it. It's real nice and cool. His vehicle form is a tank they didn't show his ability like bubbly so I don't know if he has ability or not and 
There we go. Pretty intimidating from the front. And um, these might hover, and if you go to booth, they're probably going to be the wheels. Not sure. And everybody's favorite, Grimlock. He has the Rage Dynamo ability, which means you have to kill a bunch of Septicons before you can transform into his T-Rex form. So, yeah. He looks really, really cool. He does. So, yeah. You gotta see his dinosaur mode. This is just unreal. Bum, 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 bum. This is just beast. And yeah, it really is beast. Well, this video is getting a little long, and I don't want to take let it take forever to upload. So I guess this will be the end of part one on the website. And Super Dragon 1026 out. Okay, this is Super Dragon 6 with part 2 of the Transformers Fall of Cybertron website. And, first, we'll start out with Megatron. Da -na -na. There is Megatron. Here he is. Now, he looks really bulky, just like Optimus Prime. His hover. He, his ability is cover, as you can see right over there. Um, what I don't like about, okay, I think these sparks are cool right here. And they did make his gun look pretty big, so it looks pretty cool. But the thing I don't like about it is his face. It just doesn't look Megatron to me. And here is his vehicle form. So, and the thing is, these look like wings, now don't they? So I don't know if he's going to be able to fly in this game or not. But it just looks like so small, like it's supposed to fit on somebody's shoulder. But, yeah, you can see he has little boosters, I guess, right there. And, yeah, this actually looks pretty cool. Here's Shockwave. I, he, they didn't show his his um ability yet and I don't know he might not even have an ability he didn't change whatsoever from the War for Cybertron character pack except for I think I think he might just might have had Septicon symbols on there I don't know and um, let's show you his vehicle form his vehicle form to me looks like a limo. And it doesn't really look like it's supposed to be flying. The only thing that makes it look like it's supposed to fly would be those wings. But it does look like it's supposed to be on the ground. That's, that's, yeah, I know, it just looks weird. In the DS game, he does drive on the ground, so. I don't know if he'll be able to fly in this game or not. I just don't know. And here's Starscream. The only thing that changed is I think they did a little touch up on the legs, made them a little detailer right in that, right in here. They changed that. Then they gave them those two things there, and our, I don't know. I don't know if those are new or not. No, those aren't new. And as you can see, he doesn't have Decepticon symbols anywhere. He only has, whoa, what the, I don't even think he has one, I don't see it. So, yeah, I don't, I think he, I don't know, I don't see it anywhere. So, I, yeah, I don't know. And as you can see, he does have cloaking, like I said. And the other one. Okay, so here's his vehicle form. Okay, so I guess, yeah, he does have the Decepticon symbol only in vehicle form. And you can see that those changed and that's changed. I don't know, I'm just going to do a quick look and see if I can find them. 
If I can't, I can't. Yeah, no, I don't. Okay, let's go on to Soundwave. Soundwave, believe it or not, can eject mini cons in this game. So, you're, whenever you're playing a Soundwave, get ready to eject a bunch of mini cons. Yeah, Soundwave didn't change either. I don't see really any changes. Not even in his vehicle form, as you can see. It looks, it's still the same. So yeah, I don't know. That might be new. That right there, that Septicon symbol. And that one back there. And yeah, so that might be new. Okay, here's Vortex. He has a shockwave blast. And he's one of the characters that formed Bruticus. So, the cool thing about him is when he's in helicopter mode, it looks like, I saw a preview to where his blades fold up right here and go down when he's in boost mode. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. I guess. I don't know. I don't know if you guys think it's cool, but I think that's kind of cool. And, yeah, they, on each side, they haven't released two characters yet. They're locked. Swindle has a grappling hook, just like Jazz. So yeah, Swindle looks pretty cool. Oh yeah, this looks the same right here. The wheels, the end, the hubcap. Oh yeah, this is what I don't like. It, it, it for some reason that it happens every time to me. I don't know why it just happens. And here is ah, crap. okay, good. So here is his scar form. They'll still look like Chuck with. It's a big. It's sort of big, you know. And then look, little gun. A <laughs> it's just funny. Okay, let's go to the game section. Okay, so, as you can see, here's Optimus. He's badly injured. That definitely won't keep a prime down. Optimus probably has endured more stuff than that. Here's Grimlock in the back. I guess looking at Megatron. I guess looking at Megatron right over here. Right here, it also shows what other people said about the game. So yeah, here's Megatron over here, Rockmas, and Grimlock I believe is looking at Megatron, maybe. And it shows a feature. Apocalypse setting. Massive game va gameplay variety. Epic scale. Multiplayer with truly custom characters. So I don't know if like you can paint them any color and like give them any ability and any gun that's what I'm thinking and there's a bunch of videos there's through the matrix E3 trailer Grimlock trailer and yeah there's a ton more there's yeah, as you can see it's there's a bunch and and there's so far five pages of each of these. Um, just to let you know on a warning, it so, it like repeats some pictures. Some pictures are repeated. Just a little warning. Um, I will show you one video. This is okay. So I I think this one is like the best trailer so far. This one is just cool. So there, there we go. I just show you one. Show the shop drawing. And yeah.
Yeah. I think Jazz just got Octum Shrine's gun. That's what it looks like to me. And I guess this is the part where Bumblebee loses his voice box. That's what they say. So yeah, that's that's one of them. Pretty good. Um, here's just like a little thing. Uh, you can sh you here's the pre-Civil War. War for Cybertron. You can see there's a big blowout in it. Fall of Cybertron. Giant hole and the journey. Well, let me take you back to Fall of Cybertron real quick. And uh, look, they show you like four pictures of each place in here. Oh, three. But yeah, there's four things. I think like three to four pictures. Yeah, that was four, so. And um, it shows you some pictures, what it will look like. And yeah, so and this looks really cool. What is that like Trypticon? I think that's Trypticon. It looks like Trypticon to me. Huh? That does look like Trypticon. I've never noticed that before. And then here's the pre-order screen. PC. PlayStation 3, Xbox, I I prefer Xbox, because Xbox is probably going to be good. Um, if you pre-order with GameStop, you get, uh, let's see, you get, uh, what, um, I forgot what it is, um, you get a, oh yeah, you get the G1 Retro Pack, Walmart, Amazon, Best Buy, and Activision, but Activision is only for the PC, it says. And choose your reading, whatever reading you are, and yeah. But um, these are just links, so I mean, wherever you want to go, just click on it and see. I'll just do GameStop and see it's link. It's really it. And see, it says with bonus, so includes GameStop bonus, so yeah think that's pretty cool so yeah um part one and part two i'm probably gonna link together because i don't really feel like just doing two i'm pro i'm just gonna link them together they can be different parts you know so yeah that's pretty much all i'm gonna do so yeah hope you enjoyed the video so super dragon 1026